So this video will center around the budget deficit, uh, which we will abbreviate as BD. And let's start off with the formula for the budget deficit. And the formula is BD equals PBD, which is our primary budget deficit, plus ID. Now I is the debt service payments. Debt service payments. And this is pretty much uh pretty much our interest on the debt. Interest on debt. And D D would be our uh, public debt. Public debt, or uh, we can call it our uh, government debt. And that's D. Now we can break down uh, break down our BD as follows. BD equals uh, G minus T plus ID. So essentially we're just breaking down the primary budget deficit. And breaking it down further, you get G minus TR plus TP plus ID. And that's the whole formula for the budget deficit. Now, uh, the budget deficit can be a number that's equal to zero, less than zero, or greater than zero. And when the budget deficit, when we calculate it and we it comes up to zero then we have a balanced budget and this pretty much means that we took care of the interest for this year and next year we pay the same interest on the same debt now uh, when uh, our BD is less than zero uh, then it's a budget surplus then at that time uh, our tax revenue would be greater than the combined of uh, government spending and, and transfer payments and the interest on debt and this is supposed to be a large D, no, I, D. And for example, uh, for example, let's say that our budget deficit uh, ends up to be uh, minus 10. Then in this case, TR is greater than uh, G plus TP plus I, D by 10. So TR is uh, greater than G plus TP plus ID by 10. And let's say that we uh, need to pay the, we need to pay 700 million in debt. So our debt is 700 million. So uh, now that our, in this year, our, we have a budget surplus of a uh, minus 10 or budget def or budget surplus of 10 and our budget or budget deficit is minus 10 that means that that minus 10 goes into the debt and uh, next year we only have to pay interest on a debt of uh, 690 million so essentially we just took the minus 10 and uh, we added it to the debt that we currently have outstanding and then the debt that we have to pay uh, next year is 690 so we just we had we just we were able to pay our interest and we are pay off we were able to pay off some of our debt now if BD is greater than zero then that is pretty much a budget deficit that means that the government has to borrow they have to borrow to pay off interest payments uh, I don't know why this isn't finished but I guess I forgot to finish it but they have to borrow to pay off interest payments and in this case Debt builds. So it's pretty much the opposite of a uh, budget surplus. So if it's a minus 10, then we just add it to 700. But let's say if, if our budget deficit was equal to 10, then uh, next year we'd have to pay a debt of, we have to pay the interest on a debt of 710 million. And we also have to pay off the debt in future coming years. And this is all you should. This is all I'm going to uh, teach you for this video, so please rate, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.